Hello guys, KP Shamino here. Uh, yesterday I was uh, fishing in Oregon and uh, I was trying a little bit the nano spoon there. I didn't fish a lot with the nano spoon and I was thinking maybe I can make like a little uh, series about the uniques in North Carolina with the nano spoon. So and that's what I'm going to do. So you guys see already that I got a unique white crabby. So it works. That's already very good because I didn't know that it's possible to get them on the nano spoon. In the past, I know we can get them on a really small casting spoon. If I'm not mistaken, the silver one it was. I think it was a 4G1 hook too. So I'm going to make three movies uh, about the three uniques here, the three panfish uniques. How you need to catch them, and I always going to use uh, the nano spoon. So it's like three movies with the nano spoon, and how you need to catch the unique. So the first movie did that's this one. It's uh, the unique white crappy, and you guys already can see that I got one. Uh, it wasn't that complicated because we got all the positions and the info and the time frames, so it's not that complicated. There was one major thing that I saw. I started with six G. Uh, one O nano spoon, but the action was a little bit low, so I went to the 4G one and it works really well. So you guys can see I'm now fishing for one hour in game and I already got the unique white crappy. So in this tutorial guide, I'm going to show you guys how you need to catch him. It's not that hard, it's fun, it's with level 12 gear, so the guys that just came to North Carolina, you can use this gear. Because I always try to give gear that is usable in that area. It's fun. It's like, uh, yeah, the nano spoon is very small. You can throw where you want. You always are going to get fish. So let's keep this unique white crappy. And first of all, the position. So for the guys that already saw my bobber guide about unique white crappy, it's just the same position. So it's in the... Oh, it's in the woody enchantment and you got two very nice positions here i always use the left one why i'm using the left one it's just a little bit easier to reach like white crappy likes to sit under weeds because it's a panfish and you can throw over here you got weeds at the right but it's a little bit harder to throw your spoon in it because you need to go through the weeds then you can throw from here but then the distance is a little bit further so just stand here, you can go a little bit in the water and then you can throw like this over here. And you are going to get a unique white crappy over there too. But I don't fish on that position because it's a little bit harder than the other position. So here at the left, you got like a really nice weed bed too for the white crappy. And the good position is if I can get my rod back. So you just need to go a little bit to the back. And here you see the weeds. And the good position is, of course, over here. So you can go nicely near the weeds, but you don't need to go in the weeds. So the snag is a little bit less with this setup and with this position, I mean. So what you need to do is you just throw just behind the weeds. Uh, just go with uh, five drag, uh, go with three speed, do a stop and go. You can do a lift and drop too. It doesn't matter a lot. So just drill a little bit in, stop. Just a little bit in, stop. You need to be patient. Don't go too aggressive. It's a small fish. Okay, it's a small spoon, I know. But still, you need to give the small fish time to bite. And I got most of my fish uh, after the 30 meter mark. So they are sitting very close, the white crappy. So let's have a look that we can get one in the movie. And it goes really fast. You guys can already see it. I'm now at 6 meters. So four meters, it's getting like swallow the water here. So let's go again. So it's it's very fun to fish in North Carolina with equipment like this. Not too heavy, just enough to get some white crappies in. A little bit gold, a little bit experience. So let's have another try. And if I don't have luck, it's time to show you guys the setup. So sometimes you can do a lift up. Here you go, lift and drop. Look, now a fish bites, but it's a very small one because he keeps my lure a little bit higher. That's how you can see it. 
that's how you need to do it guys and here is a fish i think it's a small one yeah it's probably a simple white crappie yeah it's white crappy that's how you need to do it guys very fun to fish it works really well i don't think it's as good as uh, going with the bobber if you want to go purely for uniques but this is a little bit more action it's uh, a little bit uh, yeah less old man style because i like the bobber fish a lot i'm just watching some series on my other screen and just watch the bobber but this is some action that's how you need to do it guys for the time frame time frame is just the same uh, sunny day 9 to 11 i got am and on a cloudy day 4 p.m until 7 p.m i'm now nicely in the cloudy time frame so it works really well i will put the time under the movie too so now it's time to check the setup the good thing about the setup is that you can get with a level 12 gear a very heavy setup so you don't need to be afraid it's not uh, that you are going to break stuff so i went with the jig winner 240 he got a lure weight of 5 to 18 gram okay i'm using a 4g one so the weight is not optimal but that doesn't really matter a lot because you don't need to make the distance so you just need to make 20 meters more than enough line weight four kilograms test that's more than enough i i can get every crappy white crappy black crappy red deer sunfish with this setup because they are not going above that number in weight then i'm going with windcast 2500 he got a test of 2.9 kilograms so that's really good too and then i'm using the fluoro 0.2 millimeter so that's the setup it's a very heavy setup for a fish like this but it's fun too it's not always need to be a fight of a couple of hours it's fun to get like the fish in throw in fish in throw in fish in that's fun i think it's fun that's the setup guys very simple setup level 12 if you guys come here to north carolina get the nano spoon okay it's gold it's not a lot i think four to five gold get some fluoro you can of course go with the mono too it doesn't matter a lot i think and that's the setup simple setup time to check the net and then the first uh, part of my series how to catch all the uniques with the nano spoon is done so uh here you see my catch and it's only for one hour you know i started at 4 pm it's now 5 pm so trophy white crappy trophy white crappy unique white crappy it gives three gold 39 experience that was it for the movie guys i hope that you like the movie give me a like if you like the movie subscribe to my channel if you like my channel and see you guys in the next movie for part two probably going to be the black crappy nano spoon action that was it for the movie bye bye